Hi and welcome to Fully Charged, my name's Robert Llewellyn and this is a show that's all about electric cars and the future of energy and the future of technology. And I went to CES earlier this year, I was taken there by Bosch, I was very lucky, I really enjoyed myself and one of the very, very big subjects that was going on there was about the Internet of Things and about how ubiquitous little sensors are and how cheap they are and how they're going to be in every single thing that we own. All the electronic things are going to talk to each other and your fridge and your car and your freezer and your front door and your lights and your heating. It'll all be connected, which means, of course, that some evil hacker will break into your system and turn the heating right up in the middle of the summer and the air conditioning right up in the middle of winter and your whole life will collapse around you and the machines will take over and they'll use your limp, semi-conscious body as an energy source. Or not, because thankfully, some very, very clever people are working on ways to stop that happening. Have a look. So I'm here with Robert Wesley from... Escript. Escript. So, Robert, one of the very interesting topics that's come up very recently since the, the advent of connected things, of, of you know, the, the Internet of Things, is security. And, it's, and I, I must admit, when I first heard about it, I just went, this is brilliant, I want, I want this in my house. And then I started, everyone was saying, yeah, but what about security? If someone can hack in and turn your fridge off or turn your lights on when you're not, or whatever. And, and I, this, this is what I've seen here very briefly gives me some reassurance that at least you're thinking about that aspect yeah. of it. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Escript's been working on security for a number of years, and uh, security is of utmost importance. Right. It's when a technology emerges, and when it just starts, that seems to, it seems to in, instill fear in people first, right. and then excitement about what it is. So, I mean, I'm assuming you're, you're aware of that, and that's really sure. what you're working on. Sure, and hopefully demonstrations like this can help uh, alleviate those right. concerns. Because uh, when I first saw it, I saw that there was like lots of things that said update, so you can, you can securely update. So in a sense, like our phones and our laptops now, right. constantly updating because they found a hole in it and someone could get in that, so you close that hole. Is, that, is right. that essentially the same idea? Yeah, essentially what we do is we provide security both on the front end and the back end. So for instance, on a home application, we provide a key management software that handles the, the key management, the, the signatures, as well as certificates. And then on the front end, we have a software called CypherLib, which is your cryptographic library, which handles that, that transaction and that security from back end to front end. Right. So this is, because uh, you, you're talking to someone who's got very limited understanding, sure. but is it so that if, if your freezer is talking, can talk to the... I don't know, to the, to the central control system that uh, uh, adjusts what, what, what power you're using at what time of day, that communication is secure as well, even internally. Correct. And, right. Correct. And, and what we show here in this application is, is you have a, a setting in your home that offers light control right. through your cell phone yeah. and heat control. And what we showcase here is without security, a hacker is able to turn your lights on, turn your lights off, right. or turn your heat on, turn your heat off. And with security, it shows that that, that hacker is unable to do this. Right, right. And, and that is an updatable system as well. Is that for Correct. remote? You can, you can remotely update that. Correct. In case someone finds a way in, you can close that door. Correct. Right. And does that, I mean, what uh, I think we don't understand yet, the sort of general consumer, is how close we are to that and how near we are to, to having that stuff implemented. It's, it's available now. Right. So could you go into a big store and buy, say, a washing machine that had that capability already? Yeah, there's already devices in the market that, that have security and, in right. fact, uh, and have escrow security. Right, right. So, yeah, that's already available today. Right. And Bosch is certainly uh, uh, on the forefront of that. Right. Thanks for watching, and you know, please subscribe. You know, the clicky, the button down there. I mean, I subscribe to other shows, and then I get updates when there's a new episode, and I'm going to be putting loads of new episodes of Fully Charged Up. So, for f sake, subscribe!